Are you running away from me, Natalie? Get out of my way! Yuck! Let go of my hand! Alright, I promise I won't touch you. Just come eat with me. Why will I ever do that? Okay, come shopping with me. Never. Come on, Natalie. Are you still mad at me for that night? Natalie was raging with anger at the audacity of this leech. Had he forgotten that he had drugged her and tried to rape her? She was doing well to not punch him unconscious at this very moment. She just did not want to react to anything this psychopath said to her. It would be a waste of her breath and energy. Let's go to that cafe over there. We'll grab some lunch and chat. I am not interested. What the hell do you want? Samuel saw the look on Bryce's face. His face was becoming darker and darker with each passing moment. He had his eyes intently looked in a particular direction. Sam followed his line of sight and saw Natalie with Howard Clare. What is he doing with her? How dare he even stand in front of her? Bryce, you should not get involved. Let me handle this. Wait. Natalie can handle herself well. Let's see what that coward tried. I am so glad you finally accepted. What would you like to eat? Natalie had only decided to walk to the cafe because she did not want to create a scene in the hallway anymore. She was still thinking of a way to get out of there. I don't want to eat. Waiter! What would you like to order, sir? The salmon, some sushi, and a bottle of red wine. What do you think, babe? I am not your babe! And don't you get it? I don't want to eat nor drink anything with you! Uh, should I come back later? Just get the dishes that I have mentioned. You better watch how you talk to me, Natalie. I hold a certain reputation in this community. Or what? Natalie was done with Howard now. Howard seemed to be pleased that he had got a reaction from Natalie. She was about to stand up when the waiter brought the wine and served it to them in two glasses. A sniff of the wine's aroma suddenly brought back that night when Howard had laced Natalie's drink. It brought back that horrible memory of that hotel room. Natalie clutched the fork and looked at Howard viciously. Why are you looking at me like that? Why are you holding that fork? I told you not to trouble me, didn't I? Bryce, we need to intervene right now! What will Bryce do? Will he intervene between Howard and Natalie? Will Natalie let her emotions get the better of her? Why keep waiting? All episodes of The Return are available only on the Pocket FM app. Click on the link in the description to install now.